I gotta make sure everything is totally fine. I gotta make sure that there's no doors open, nothing in the way. Everything's good. My room, everything's fine. We're good. Okay, I guess we're good. Welcome, everybody, and thank you for helping me reach 100 subscribers on YouTube. I know that I'm making this a big deal. And in reality, it is. You know why? Because it's a milestone that I set for myself because I'm a realistic person and I don't think I'm ever going to become a big YouTuber. But hey, I wanted to do something nice for you guys. So thank you for anybody who asked me questions. Uh, but, you know, I hope maybe next milestone, I don't know if it'll be 200 or 250 or whatever. We can get even more questions. Whatever. Point is, thank you. And I hope that your questions are answered thoroughly and to your satisfaction. And if not, then I don't care because I'm editing this video once and I'm not doing it again. So Angelism asks, do you have your powers yet? And his name is actually Chips from the Jailbreak server that I now have my powers in yet. Um, so yeah, the answer is yes. I have my powers in the, the yes, I do. Huzzah. I, it's, it's a miracle. I, I know it, it is, but, but I have them. And my life asks, is your name Jeff? You know, this has been a question that several people have asked me and it's about time that I just come out and say it. My name is Jeff. Fish Souls asks, do you enjoy your career? If so, what about it? Um, what career, good sir? I don't make money off these YouTube videos, nor do I have a job. My career is just my hobby, which is actually not even making these montages. It's taking photography. I love photography. No, uh, okay. I enjoy doing this. Editing the videos can be tedious at times, but it's satisfying work, and when I motivate myself to do it, it's worth all the effort that I put in, and seeing you guys comment on it is just all the more reason why I continue to do this stuff, because I, I like it, and you guys like it, win-win, you know, no big deal. I just, you know, why not give you guys some entertainment, especially to those who I consider friends, you know, getting to hear their thoughts on it and watching it with them, you know, really just makes me smile and just lets me know that I'm not, not, not a bad editor, I, I guess. Ultimate HQ says, how's life? Dude, I'm in college. It's my first semester. I gotta wake up at 7, and I gotta drive about 40 minutes there and 40 minutes back. And that's the most enjoyable part of my day. If that doesn't answer that question, then I don't know what does. Okay, no, in reality, college is actually so far doing well. You know, I'm, I'm doing well in college. I mean, it's taking a lot of my time away from, you know, doing things that I want to do, like spending time with friends, but I've been able to keep up on my work so that I can do things like spend time with friends and edit, and that, that, that's why I make montages, because I, 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 I have free time to do this stuff. Because uh, I, I, I prioritize and organize myself like a good boy. Nathan Master says, what other content do you plan on doing in the future? Well, this is something that I've thought to myself, and I'm not entirely sure if I'm ever going to act upon it due to college, but I've thought about doing a couple of, not review kind of videos, if there's like a Halloween update that happens, and this video might be posted after that happens, so forgive me. I was considering maybe doing a review of the update. Um, I was also considering of doing like a kind of tips and tricks video when it comes to Degroot Keep specifically with demo nighting and also Flog Pyro. I can't really uh, think of anything else. They're really, you know, the only thing that I'm really doing is montages. I know that it sounds like I really should have something else that I should do, but I think that it's really enough for now. Um, I just want to try to put more variety in said montages and do more random stuff um, so it's not so formulaic. Um, it's pretty much like, you know, like Soundsmith's monthly meatloaf videos or whatever, like, like I said in my, uh, trailer for the channel. So, I understand that some people might be expecting me to do some big whole series like Lazy Purple's How It Feels or, or Soundsmith's, you know, stereotypes, but I'm not, I don't, I'm not even planning on becoming a big TF2 YouTuber or, or YouTuber in general. I'm doing this because it makes me feel like I'm, an, uh, I'm a good editor, like I'm actually a professional editor recording things in a pretty decent quality, and it makes me feel just, you know, nice to get all of the all of the comments and all of the, you know, support. That's really it. I'm not planning on having a career or, you know, just, you know, ma even making more variety of content. I might. I might. It, I, it's doubtful, but I might. King's Hamzilla asks, what is your favorite plane? Well, the answer to that is actually very simple. I have two planes in my room, and I've had them since I was a child. My dad made them, actually, and um, they're very uh, nice, and I like them a lot, and yeah, uh, those are the planes that I actually 
would say that I like the most. So that's your answer. Mega Gay asks, what is your favorite thing to do when you're free and have nothing to do? Well, it's a shame that I'm in college and have no free time whatsoever. And I'm sorry for fixing my camera, but I, I have no time. I, I, dude, do you really think a 19 year old boy in college trying to be an engineer and trying to take physics and calculus too has free time? No. I play TF2 with friends. That, that, that's all I really do. I mean, okay, I watch YouTube. Who doesn't? Mega Kid asks, what do you think you need to tell YouTubers who are just starting out? Don't do it. It's a dead-end job. You will never become a big YouTuber. It's not worth it. Work at a freaking Domino's Pizzeria. It's an easier way to make money than YouTube. Trust me. I've seen enough videos to have more than enough evidence supporting the fact that it's like really unlikely unless you network to hell and back again to become a big YouTuber. I'm speaking blunt, but it's really, really true to be quite honest. AJ asks, what is your favorite or least favorite fruit or vegetable? And possibly why? Um, I'm not a picky eater. I guess I like um, uh, cantaloupe. Uh, I mean, like, I don't really have a least favorite or, or most fa I mean, like, I like Brussels sprouts. I like spinach. Um, I, 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 I don't know. What? Well, uh, the parsnip. That's my least favorite vegetable. Who eats parsnips? I, I don't know. Whatever. Maybe radishes. I, I don't dislike them. What? Okay. Musical Kiwi asks, Why my pee pee is so hard? I, I don't know. I think you need to see a doctor. You may have a case of mesothelioma, and you can be entitled to financial compensation if reported to the Federal Bureau of Investigations. Dan asks, how has TF2 changed your life? Okay, big question here. And the big answer, TF2 has been a part of my childhood. It was the first and only game that I've really played that is a first-person shooter, you could say. It continues to be a game that I will continue to play, and I've played for four to five years now. And, you know, I remember a lot of things from my first year, although it was kind of, it's kind of, you know, blurring now. You know, the Mario Kart map. Who doesn't know Mario Kart 2v30? Uh, you know, I remember going on a, on a trade community server and, you know, that, uh, that uh, stemmed to being an admin with a friend of another um, community that, you know, d did giveaways. I became a community leader of a, of a, you know, community with, you know, regular servers, you know, trade servers, Death Run and whatnot. I remember doing giveaways on Death Run. I was like the most active and entertaining admin in the community. And I unfortunately left because I felt like it wasn't that rewarding of a job. But I, you know, I, I'm now an admin of another community that feels a lot more rewarding and I plan to stay here. But it's just, it has changed my life. I've met a lot of friends here who I ha have known for these four to five years. Uh, a, a couple of them the entire duration of my TF2 experience. And I've gotten to, you know, learn. I've gotten to help friends through their problems and I've gotten to play with other friends on different games it's just been a gateway it's been a gateway and, and it's been a really great just a, a really great game and, and you know it, it does more it's more than just playing a game it's more than just a silly thing it, it really helped me form a lot of friendships semicolon backslash and this is the final question asks when will you do a two port ng intel room montage you want a montage of the engineer just putting his, his nest in, 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 in two fort and getting kills with it? Like, as if, as if by now everybody in the entire TF2 community doesn't know that when you play two fort, there will be an engineer in the intel room? Like, you really think that people are just gonna walk into the intel room and get blasted? That's what you're looking for? Well, fine, here you go. Let's do this.